I know, an absolutely heartbreaking story out of Naugatuck. A young boy abused and now his mother and stepfather are under arrest facing a number of charges. We do want to warn you, some of these details are really tough to hear. Naugatuck police arrested 29-year-old Caitlin Baptiste and 31-year-old Kevin Grant on Friday. According to investigators, Grant made Baptiste's son sleep in a locked laundry room for months. He would also punish him by forcing him to drink hot sauce until he vomited and kneel on uncooked rice and tacks for hours. As for Baptiste, police say she actually was aware what her husband was doing to her child and she did nothing. The news, as you can imagine, leaving neighbors just stunned and horrified. It just broke my heart and this child is scarred for life. So I pray that somebody comes along and takes that whatever he endured in, the, in his home where he's supposed to feel safe. He overcomes this as he grows up. Very well said. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarlane has been working on this story all day. He is joining us live outside the Naugatuck Police Department. Matt, the story just makes me so many others sick. How were police finally alerted to this alleged abuse? Well, Aaron, it was actually the Department of Children and Families that got an anonymous complaint back on October 1st. That's when they, along with the Naugatuck Police Department, started looking into this. During an interview, the boy allegedly said that the abuse went back to June of this year, and he told them that it continued up until the point when DCF showed up at his house and eventually moved him to his grandmother's home. It really is just so horrifying to hear the alleged details in this case, and obviously it raises a lot of questions from many of us. What are Naugatuck police saying about the case right now? Well, yeah, well, right now they're not saying much. The Naugatuck Police Department says that they uh, won't be commenting on camera just due to the sensitive nature of this case and this investigation. Uh, as for the two folks that are charged, Baptiste and Grant, they are both out on bond and they are due back in court next month. Just terribly sad. Matt McFarlane reporting live for us from Naugatuck. Matt, thank you very much.